Hey guys and welcome back to another video. As you can see, I got dirt everywhere, even on my nose. That's because I'm at the garage and I'm working on the car. So right now we're about to replace my um, CV axle hub bearing and um, adjust the preload on the springs. So let me show you what that looks like. So right here, this was way too stiff, I mean way too tight and it was causing a lot of impact which caused my hub and bearing to break uh, very very easily for the second time so we're going to be adjusting that well we already adjusted that you can see where the wheel was hitting it because it was going back and forth and um that's already adjusted now we got to do the other side once we put this side back together and we got the new hub and bearing in there and along with that guys on the previous video i didn't go much in depth but we got the headers right here the new Mishimoto hoses we installed and um, as you guys saw the process uh, very simple and easy not too hard just got to take off the two bolts down there that connect to the exhaust and all of these up here and then the head is pretty much good to go take it out wrap it yourself and with this Mishimoto uh, I recommend you guys just starting from down there let it drain all out and then switch that hose and then you can switch that hose once everything is drained and make sure you put a lot of coolant back in there let it run and then see if it needs any more coolant like mine did and yeah so so far that's all that we got done to the car um that's new and i'll be going in depth on everything else that's done to the car um in the next video all right for now I'm waiting on josh to get back and we're gonna put this puppy together and hopefully nothing will happen to my hub and bearing and i'll see you guys when it's done all right Alright guys, so it is Saturday. Unfortunately, I didn't get to film us fixing that right hand side because it kind of got late. Um, since we had to push the bearing inside, you know, the stuff and the hub as well. Kind of messed up the first bearing. They kind of did it wrong. So we had to wait, get another bearing, come back the next day and we did it very late at night. So I didn't get a chance to film that, but I just want to let you guys know that it has been fixed. I also put new tires on. For now, the tires are a little bit smaller than what I like. Uh, it gave me a one finger gap between my tires and my fenders. It's not my favorite, but I'll be getting a little bit bigger tires once um, they have them available where they do my stretch tires at. And then we'll be popping those on and getting that perfect fitment, all right? We have a car show tomorrow, cancer. Uh, for a cancer patient, you know, we're raising money for him. So that should be fun. The car doesn't look the most appealing right now as it used to be um, back in the other car shows. But we'll see what we can do, you know. Just there to have fun. I'll try and film what I can for you guys. And I'll make a whole separate video for that. Alright guys, so we're pretty much all done with everything for today and for this video. I'm sorry it's so long and you guys didn't really get to see much. But um, I'm trying to record as much as I can when I can. Again, I'm mostly working on the car and... I don't really have a tripod to sit the camera on perfectly for you guys to be able to see everything. But um, here's what the car looks like for tomorrow. I know we still don't have the other front bumper installed yet. So we're going to have to do it with this one. Again, it's for cancer uh, patients. So not really a biggie there to support him and help him pay for his medical treatment. But that's how she's looking for tomorrow. I already cleaned her and I'm gonna have to wipe her down again tomorrow morning uh, once we get to the show we got like two hours of downtime before it starts but um yeah that's how she's looking now let me show you guys the interior pieces so don't mind this wear and tear I don't know how it got brown or whatever the stuff is I'm gonna try and get it out some other time but um interior that's how she's looking for now and don't mind the steering wheel that my dog beat up 
I will be getting another one. But yeah, I tried to clean the car the most that I could. That's how it looks inside for now. More to come later on when I have a little bit more money to play with. Um, cleaned everything that I could. There's my sign jacket in the back. But yeah. So far, that's, that's how we'll be rolling tomorrow, boys. Now, the engine bay looking crispy clean as well. But the most that I could do with it for the time being. He still got some of the marks from the cleaner. All right, that's how it's looking for tomorrow, boys. Whew. Pretty hot still. Just... Oh yeah, my spigots fell off. <laughs> anyway, all right, guys. Well, thank you so much for watching the video. Leave a thumbs up if you like it. If you leave a thumbs down let me know why in the comments below so i can try and improve but um yeah one last look at the car that's how we roll in tomorrow boys see you guys then all right peace